Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of WebTech Tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to delete your Shopee account. Delete your Shopee account, you can only do this with your Shopee application. So tap open your Shopee application from your app drawer and make sure that you're logged into your account. From the main homepage of Shopee app, tap on the me button at the bottom right hand corner. Now tap on the settings button or the gear button at the top right. Scroll all the way down and you'll be able to see an option that says request account deletion tap on it and tap on ok in the pop-up to proceed further go through the information first it says that if you continue deleting your account any remaining coins in your account will be deleted as well your account should not have any pending purchases or sales to delete your account once you go through all of the information and you are sure you'd like to delete tap on proceed at the bottom now tap on the next button and now on the next page you need to type in a verification code sent to your mobile number via voice call. Once you receive it, type it in, in the text box and tap on the next button. Soon after your mobile number has been verified, select a reason for your account deletion, enter your email address and finally click on submit in order to request to delete your Shopee account. How to change language in Shopee. Now well, let's get started. Tap open your Shopee application on your mobile device and make sure that you're logged in first. From the main homepage of Shopee, tap on the me button with a human figure in it at the bottom right hand corner. Now select the gear icon at the top right from your account settings tab. You'll be able to see an option that says language. Give it a tap and you'll be able to see two languages displayed on the screen. Select the language you prefer from the options and give it a tap. Soon after you select your language, tap the tick mark at the top right hand corner. Now your Shopee app will restart and be ready to use with a different language you selected. That is how you can easily change your language on your Shopee app. Guide you through how to log into your Shopee application. Now let's get started. The first thing to do is make sure you've downloaded Shopee application on your Android device or your iOS device and simply tap it open. Once you have an account, you can pretty much easily log into your account. Go to the me button at the bottom right corner with a human icon in it and give it a tap. Now, if you already have an account, you can go and tap on the login button at the upper right corner. Or if you don't have an account yet, start by signing up to a new account. Go and tap on the sign up button and you can enter your mobile number in order to sign up to your account. Or you can even sign up using your Google account, your Facebook account and with your Apple account. Once you have an account, tap on log in and go ahead and enter your credentials. In the first text field, you can go ahead and enter your phone number, email or your username. You can enter any one of them. Now move on to the next field and type in your password for your account. Make sure to type in the correct password while logging into your account and if you want to double check your password before moving on, click on this eye icon at the right corner. In case you've forgotten your password, tap on forgot at the right corner of the page. Once you're done, you can go ahead and tap on the login button. And soon after you do that, you'll be able to log into your Shopee application. How to download Shopee application on your device. Now let's begin. Shopee Private Limited is a Singaporean multinational technology company that focuses mainly on e-commerce. In order to download Shopee, you can simply go to your Play Store for your Android and you can visit your App Store for your iOS device. Search for Shopee in the search box and soon after you do that, you'll be able to find the application in the search results. If you don't find it there, you can simply go visit your web browser and type in Shopee Download APK. Soon after you do that, you'll be able to see numerous of search results appearing on your display. You can download the application according to your location. Tap on any search result that matches your location and then you can go ahead and download it on your device. You can also download this application which is called Aptoid and once you tap that app open, go to the search button at the bottom and search for Shopee. From the search results, tap on this application right here and simply tap on the install button. If your location supports the application, then you'll be able to find it in the Play Store or App Store. If not, you'll need to download a third-party application and then search for Shopee. Wait for the download to finish. Now, go to your settings from the pop-up and tap on Allow from the source and then go back. Now tap on the install button and then you are done downloading the app. Simply tap it open and there you go. That is how you can easily download Shopee application on your Android device. How to reset your Shopee account's password when you've forgotten your password and can't log into your account. Now let's get started. Click open your web browser first 
Once you do that, go to www.shopee.com and press the enter. From the options displayed, click your region or your country and at the upper right corner, click on between. Now, enter your credentials, that is your phone number, your username or your email in the first text field. Now, move on to the next field and if you remember your password, you can go ahead and enter it right here. If not, click on I forgot my password. Now on the next page, in order to reset your password, you will need to enter your credentials, enter your phone number or your email address that is associated with the account. Once you do that, click on the next button, go through a verification and a verification email will be sent to the email address that is associated with the account. Click on OK, go ahead and simply click open the email. Once you receive the email, you can click on the link displayed and on the next page, you'll be able to create a password for your account. Create a new password that you would like to reset to and make sure your passwords meet these criteria. Once you're done, click on continue and you'll successfully be able to reset your Shopee account's password. Now go ahead and enter your credentials in order to log into your account. Enter the password you just changed to and click on between or login. How to create a Shopee account. Shopee Private Limited is a Singaporean multinational technology company which focuses on e-commerce. Shopee was first launched in Singapore in 2015 and later expanded its reach to Malaysia, Thailand, Taiwan, Indonesia, Vietnam, the Philippines, Brazil and Mexico. It is a great platform for those who want to purchase and sell their goods online. So without further ado, let's get started. Click open a web browser first and in the search box type in shopee.com and press the enter on your keyboard. From the very first interface of the website, click on your country or region and soon after you do that, you'll end up in the official website. In order to create an account, go and click on the sign up button at the upper right and then enter your phone number in the text field. Once you enter your phone number, click on the next button. You can also sign up using your Facebook, Google or your Apple account. Sign into your social networking site, whatever you choose. In my case, I'm using my Facebook, so let me go ahead and enter my Facebook credentials. Start by entering your email or your phone number in the first text field, and then go ahead and enter your Facebook password, and then click on login. And soon after you do that, you'll be signed up to Shopee using your Facebook account. How to cancel an order on your Shopee account. Now let's get started. Start by clicking open your web browser and sign into your Shopee account. As soon as you open your web browser, type in www.shopee.com and press the enter on your keyboard. Sign into your account if necessary. And after you're signed in, from your home screen, go and click on your profile picture at the upper right and click on My Purchase. In this page, you'll be able to see the list of all the purchases you're about to make or you've already made. Simply click on Cancel Purchase from this page and you'll be able to cancel an order in Shopee. If you want to remove an order from your shopping cart, you can go and click on the shopping basket icon at the upper right and you'll be able to see all of the purchases you're about to make. Click on delete in order to delete an order. How to cancel an order on your Shopee account. Now let's get started. Start by clicking open your web browser and sign into your Shopee account. As soon as you open your web browser, type in www.shopee.com and press the enter on your keyboard. Sign into your account if necessary. And after you're signed in, from your home screen, go and click on your profile picture at the upper right and click on My Purchase. In this page, you'll be able to see the list of all the purchases you're about to make or you've already made. Simply click on Cancel Purchase from this page and you'll be able to cancel an order in Shopee. If you want to remove an order from your shopping cart, you can go and click on the shopping basket icon at the upper right and you'll be able to see all of the purchases you're about to make. Click on delete in order to delete an order. How to log into Shopee.com Now let's get started. Click open your web browser. You can open any web browser you want. And soon after you do that, go to the search box and type in www.shopee.com and press the enter on your keyboard. Soon after you do that, you'll end up in this page. Go ahead and select your country from the displayed options. And once you do that, go and click on the login button at the upper right from the official website of Shopee. You'll end up in the login box. Just enter your phone number, your username or your email in the first text field and move on to the next field and type in your password. If you want to double check your password, you can click on this eye icon at the right corner so that you can reveal them before moving on. If you've forgotten your password, click on Forgot Password link right below the login button and follow the instructions to reset to a new password. 
If you want to log in with your SMS option, click on login with SMS and an SMS verification code will be sent to your mobile number. Simply enter the code and you'll be able to log into your account just like that. You can also log in using your Facebook account, your Google account and your Apple account. After you're done entering the credentials, click on the login button. And just like that, you'll be logged into your Shopee account. Go through the categories displayed and start shopping. How to change language on Shopee? Now well, let's get started. It's pretty quick and easy to change language on your Shopee. In order to do so, click open a web browser. Let me open Google Chrome for my video. And once you do that, go to the URL box at the top and type in shopee.com and search. Choose your country or your region from the display options. And soon after you do that, you'll be able to see that there is a pop-up at the upper right corner where you can select your language. You can simply change to your desired language by simply selecting from the pop-up. If you want to change it to English, then simply click on the English button. You can see that the language on your display has been changed. If you want to change to other languages, then click on this button that says translate this page at the upper right and click on the three dots. Click on choose another language and from the drop down, select a language of your choice. After you do that, click on translate and there you go. There are multitudes of languages available. Simply click on the drop down and you can scroll through the options and choose your preferred language. That is how you can easily change language on Shopee. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.